Hey everyone, this is Jonathan Bash and welcome to my fashion channel. Today I have the honor and privilege to be with one of my greatest friends. We've known each other for 17 years. This is Aimbal Baton and uh, she has an amazing new program and I want you to explain to everyone what this program is about and why it is so important. <laughs> developed a program called Fishbowl uh, Youth Entrepreneurs and basically it's to help kids and young adults build a, a brand or, um, or a product and actually help them from A to Z on execution and finding their vision and um, what's their mission and who's their competition and everything that kind of goes into the business. and. The biggest part of it really is to help with social skills and to build confidence and to really teach kids um, that they can achieve anything. They don't have to wait until they're adults. And what I love about that is I wish I had a mentorship or someone that believed in me yeah. or someone that actually like took themselves seriously as a child and young adult to yeah, be able fun. to give you the confidence you need. I mean, we were as children and we come from that generation mm -hmm that, you know, we always were told, what do you want to be when you grow up? Right. But now it's like, what do you want to do now? Right, You know, exactly. and parent support is very, also very important. Yeah, of course. But now a business can be established just by a click of a button. Of course. It all, course. Com it all comes with an idea. Right. All yeah. business, all art, everything just comes with your personal idea. Yeah. So it's so amazing what you're doing because, no, Honestly, it makes me want to cry. When I was a kid, I wish I had a platform like this because uh, I always wanted to be around people. Still this, to this day, I want to be around people that are like-minded and, and driven and ambitious and doing what they love to do. Right. And But as kids, we never had outlets like that. Right. So it's such an incredible idea that you came up with and it's also such an amazing opportunity for these young adults and kids to know that they don't have to wait till they grow up to be able to accomplish their dreams. Right, no, I agree. And I, and I think it's really important to allow your kids to create these things and not to put so many barriers. Obviously, if it's not you know good or not safe or stuff like that, then I can understand, but not to ever tell them, no, you can't do it, or it's too hard to get to that step, or. You know, when, you, when you're already an adult and you have to pay for rent and you have expenses and you have credit cards and you have children, you have all these different things that come first before your passion, right? I mean, my children are, are my passion, they're my everything, but what they want to do comes first. And if, when you're a kid, you don't have all these things. No. You don't have all these barriers, I guess, that stop you, you from The things. barriers aren't even in your mentality. Right. But... If you're not given this opportunity to kids and you're just kind of saying, you know, we'll see when you finish high school, we'll see yeah. when you're done with college, because we'll see when you get to it. I, and then a lot yeah. of times, sometimes you don't have, you know, when you, when you actually are at that stage, it becomes a lot more difficult. To but if you can prove your parents wrong while you're younger and, yeah. and be able to produce and be successful, I mean, look, there's kids on YouTube now that are making multi millions and millions and millions of dollars. Right. Uh, a year right. just by promoting a toy. Right. Also, what's so great about what you're doing, first of all, inspiring kids to be who they are and inspiring them that their ideas are as, are as as valid as anyone else's, no matter how old they are. Right. I mean, I, when I wanted to start my fashion career, I mean, I knew at three years old what I wanted to do, but it wasn't until I was seven where I was literally sketching and sketching. Mm -hmm. And sketching and made a whole portfolio mm -hmm. and it, to this day I mean it's not age me but yeah since I was seven years old I took it very 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 seriously yeah. and I wish like I had my family or like a loved one or a mentor outside of my family that took it as seriously as me that's a tip but you know I graduated and I and you made did. it I made it happen yeah. Yeah, with, yeah. because I believed in myself right. you always have to believe in yourself you don't necessarily have to believe or take anyone else's opinion right, serious. Right, right, right. But I, I think that just the, the also working in a social group that everyone kind of has the same goal in mind and, and it's 
you know, it, and it's also going through the experience. Not everyone will have, a, a, you know, a clothing line that's gonna be super successful, but it's the journey that they're taking with it and the experiences and what they take from it and, and, and the communication with other. And also, the parents allowing the, the kids to do this builds this relationship that a lot of parents don't really have, unfortunately, right now with the kids. You know, so you do sports and you do other activities and sometimes, you know, one of the parents maybe doesn't connect to that sport or doesn't understand. Like, if you're supporting your kid in something that they believe in and you're saying, yeah, go for it. And yeah, I, I, I believe in you. And let's see where it takes you. And it just builds so much confidence and such a strong relationship with the parents and with just within the kid that like anything else that comes, to them if it's like struggles at school or stuff like that it's not it doesn't it doesn't have that much weight anymore because it's like i'm an entrepreneur i'm doing good yeah i'm, I'm i have something that i believe in that i'm able to execute i'm going to be meeting with them you know every tuesday and i have my farmer's market and i have my etsy account and so on and so forth and that's always kind of just the confidence that they have exactly and that's yeah. what's so brilliant about this entire venture and you should be very proud of yourself you. because it's something I wish I had. Thank it's you. something I still wish I had. Yeah. <laughs> I never had a mentor growing up. I never. I always had to hustle and bustle and learn from the bottom up and do it all on my own. Right. And uh, but you know that makes you stronger too. But also having a support system, especially with other kids your age, parents believing in you and letting you get to that point of your confidence being so high that you know that you're able to make any dream come true. Yeah. But what's also so fascinating about it is the generation and the years that we're living in now. Right. You could literally do anything with a click of a freaking button. Right, right. And, and you have to give that access. You have to allow, it has to be used for benefit. A lot of the social media and a lot of the stuff that's out there because a lot, you know, Kids are using it at a, such a young age. They're not taught in school how to use social media. They don't know the benefits and they don't know the down, you know, parts of it. But we're teaching it. Yeah, but yeah. In, but in your case, with what you're doing is you're showing them the benefits yeah. of how you could utilize social media mm -hmm. and make it very lucrative right. with your own artistic uh, business beliefs and your own just being an artist or just doing what you want to do, just yeah. being an entrepreneur. So. Yeah. Thank you for what you're doing. You're going to change the world. I'm excited. And, Thank you. Uh, tell everyone the name and how. Uh, Fishbowl Youth Entrepreneurs. You can go on fishbowlyouth.com. You can get more information for upcoming events and upcoming seminars and classes. Okay. I love you. you. Love you Thanks for what you're Thank doing. Thank you so much.